on. So I want to talk about the Bernie bros. Mm -hmm. um, the one thing that connects women on the left and women on the right, I have found at least a lot of guest hosts, a lot of guests that have come on over the three years I've been here, is the abuse that we have all been subjected to by Bernie bros. It is by far, of anything I've ever done in my entire life, the most violent, the most misogynistic, the most sexist, the most harmful. My mother has cried over doctored photos Bernie brothers have sent me, and I'm just mm -hmm. one story. He has a real problem, mm -hmm. and I don't think that he's doing enough to tamper it down. Mm -hmm. If it were anyone, I'd say this has no representative of me. It's disgusting. It's vitriolic, and every time I see him talk about it, he's like, doesn't represent me. Move on. Mm -hmm. You're a extremely powerful woman. How do you feel that he's attached to this deeply misogynistic, and I would go so far as to say violent, mm -hmm. sector of people? Yeah, you know, and I think um, internet culture can often be very toxic, and whether we are cognizant of it or not, it nearly always concentrates on women, people of color, mm -hmm. queer people. Definitely. Um, and we experience the brunt of it. And um, I think, you know, I, I think that to a certain extent, you know, we have to always reject hate, reject vitriol, um, and denounce that kind of behavior. Um, also, you know, we also know the amount of anonymous activity that happens on the internet, and that simply is difficult. It is difficult to control when you have like a, you know, a, a, a Twitter handle with a bunch of numbers on it with two followers that are lobbying vitriol at you. We don't know where that comes from, yeah. but I know that it doesn't. Do you think come he's done enough pain. to try and stop it? You know, I think he works very hard. I think we send out, so we send out um, messaging emails, and you know what? It's I've been subject to a lot of this stuff from all sorts of the all sorts of pockets of, from the internet. ICE and CBP officers um, targeted me on Facebook for attacks when I went yeah. to visit the border. Um, they photoshopped, you know, people who are supposed to be protecting immigrants and children. Uh, photoshopped. He's got to do more. Horrendous. He's got. He's got to. He's got to. He's got to stand up and say it every day if he needs to. Yeah. Stop this. We're not accepting so, it. Sure. It's not good for us. Yeah. We're coming back with more with Representative Alexandria Ocasio Cortez.